Hellcat. Yo, what is up, people of YouTube? It's your boy Mas, and welcome back to another video. So, in today's video, guys, we'll be doing something different. Gagawa ako na dynamite. So, as you can see, guys, hindi to yung ingredients natin. But before we start cooking, let's put the most important sa ating katawan for our safety. 3, 2, 1! So, yun na nga, guys. I already have my apron with me. I already wore it. And then, now, series my ingredients. Anyways, guys. Anyways, guys, let's start our diet. So, yun na nga, guys, no? Um... So yun na nga guys, ready na tayo mag-start sa paggawa nating na ating dynamite. So before we start cooking or making our dynamite, dropping, so should I say, um, ito yung mga kailangan na ingredients. So our first ingredients na kailangan is siling green. So yun yun, yun yung ilarap na natin lalagay yung ham and then yung cheese natin. So speaking of ham and cheese, kailangan natin ng ham, of course, and then kailangan din natin ng cheese. Of course, to wrap our dynamite, we need wrapper. So in our case, meron kasing mga nabiling maliliit na green na na sile. So meron kami ng matira dito na spring roll wrappers na six inches square. And then yung binili na binili ko kanina is eto ng eight point five inches na square. And then ito yung gagamitin para dito sa mga malalaki. Take note din guys na if gagawa kayo ng dynamite, make sure na yung sili niyo is magento kalaki para masarap at para you know gato kasi talaga pag dynamite so if you use something like this one or meron pang mas maliit dito hmm, hindi siya yun yung usual size ng dynamite pero dahil sayang gagamitin ko na rin siya maski maliit let's start cooking our dynamite so our first step is to wear our gloves ito meron akong gloves dito Why do we need to wear gloves? So, we need to wear gloves kasi magihiwa tayo later ng sikli. And then, pag hindi tayo nag-wear ng gloves, our hands will burn until, probably until bago tayo matulog or habang natutulog tayo. And we don't want that. So, if possible, kailangan magsuot na lang kayo ng dynamite. Huh? Ay, no! <laughs> Ay, ng gloves! <laughs> so, if possible, magsuot kayo ng gloves. <laughs> Hindi na kayo na Sorry po, Derek. <laughs> Sorry po, Derek. <laughs> Suot na natin yung gloves natin. And then, para mas... Ewan ko, hindi na siya. Ayaw na lang bumasa. <coughs> okay na yan, guys. So, I like it. I like to wash my hands muna with the gloves on. Alright, so I already, I already washed my hands with the gloves. Proceed to slicing our... Um, ceiling green. So, in this, so make sure guys, um, na hinugasan niyo yung ceiling green nyo para mali, malinis. Prior to this video, I already washed it kanina. So, ang gagawin niyo lang is, is a slice niyo siya. Slice from this part to this part. So, once na nakapag-create na kayo ng ganitong hiwa, what you're gonna do is, aalisin niyo yung buto. I'm gonna use this small na charita. Okay. So, that is what I'm gonna use. Mag-ingat lang kayo, please, baka tumaksin. There you go, naalis na natin yung buto sa loob. So, tapusin lang natin, tapusin lang natin lahat to. Tanggalan lang natin siya ng buto and then we'll proceed to the next step. 
So there we go guys, we're done slicing our ceiling green. Ready na siya para lagyan ng cheese and then ng ham. But before natin ilagay cheese and ham, we need to slice this into strips pa haba siya. And then as well as the ham, kailangan pa haba din. I-slice na muna natin yung ham natin. So, I, I, I just removed my gloves and then I washed my hands. So, now, kumuha tayo ng tatlo muna. And then, i-slice natin siya pahaba. So, ito yung knife. Kailangan natin siya i-slice pa ba? Around half an inch. So after slicing the ham, guys, let's transfer it to a clean plate. Let's set this aside for a while. After slicing the ham, guys, let's proceed on slicing our cheese. So, is a slice natin yung cheese same as the ham. So, kung paano natin is slice yung ham, ganun din natin is slice yung cheese. our ham and cheese guys we are now ready to wrap our ceiling green but before we wrap our ceiling green kailangan natin ilagay yung ham and then yung cheese sa loob nitong ceiling green so we open natin yung spring roll wrappers natin and then tatanggalin lang natin siya isa isa So after natin guys, paghiwahiwalayin yung mga wrapper, um, kung iset aside na natin itong cho um, chopping board natin and then kumuha na tayo ng clean na plate where we can put our wrapper para malagay na natin yung ham and cheese sa loob ng ating green na sili. And then after that, ira-wrap na natin siya in our wrapper. Kukuha tayo ng sili. Then, maglagay tayo ng ham sa loob. And then next guys, kukuha tayo ng cheese. Ilalagay natin sa loob. After that, i-wrap na natin siya sa wrapper natin.
is it guys, tapos na natin siyang i-rap sa wrapper natin. So, our, our last step is to fry it sa pan natin. So, medium heat lang dapat para hindi siya masunog. And then, ilagay na natin siya pag mainit na yung matika. So, let's go and fry it. So, yes, that is it guys. Tapos na tayo sa ating dynamite. Ayan, merong malaki, merong mahaba. Really easy to make and mabilis lang siyang gawin, actually. And then, perfect for meriendas talaga. So, I hope you like it. And then now, we're gonna do some taste test. So, let's go! So, I'm really, really excited dahil mahilig talaga ako sa maanghang. And sana, wish ko is maanghang siya talaga. That depends on the ceiling green din kasi. You can see the inside guys. Wow! Shrap. Shrap. <laughs> so... Thank you so much guys for watching. I really enjoyed doing this and then eating it after. So, hindi lang naman ako kakain ito. Kakain din kami. So, thank you so much guys for watching. You can try this on your own and then comment down below if I helped you guys. And then, this is just a fun video kung paano ko siya ginawa. And then, I'm serious. Tumatahol. So, thank you so much guys for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to say something, comment down below. And then, don't forget to subscribe. Turn on the post notification so that you'll be notified whenever I post a new video. Thank you so much guys for watching. And until next time, peace!